Okay, when we're doing estimation, you want to round it to about one significant figure. So that one there rounds to 900 plus 400, and then you just work it out. So this one here would be 600 plus 700, and then you work it out. So it should be quite straightforward. 100 minus, 900 minus 100 is 800. 5,000 minus 600 is 4,400. This one here, 2,000 minus 400 is 1,600. 8 add 10 is 18. So it's 50 minus 5. So you're trying to get just one significant figure. 40 add 100, 140. 2 times 7 is 14. 6 times 7 is 42. 40 times 20 is 800. 4, 8 times 80, 4, 8 is 32, and then put down two zeros. 60 times 10, 600. 6 times 30 is 18 with a zero. 30 times 300 is 9 with three zeros. 200 times 90, two nines, and then three noughts. Oops, sorry, it's now put in 3,000. 4,000 times 2 is 8,000. 2 times 8,000 is 16,000. 50 times 5 times 8. So you go 5 times 8 is 40. 50 times 40. 5 fours are 20 and put down 2 knots. Question 3. 60 divided by 10 is 6. 60 divided by 4 is 15. 7 Divide it by 10, that's just 7 tenths or 0 0.7. 400 divided by 20, take off a naught, comes 40 divided by 2 is 20. 900 divided by 60, take off a naught. Now 90 divided by 6, you can write it as a fraction. If you can't get these ones, don't worry too much about it. You can divide top and bottom by 3 to give you 30 over 2. And that cancels down into 15. This one is 7,000 divided by 5. So I'm just going to write that out as a wee sum. 7,000 divided by 5. 5 into 7 goes 1, so we under 2. 5 into 20 goes 4 times, and 5 into naught, and 5 into naught. So the answer is 1,400. 700 divided by 2 is 350. 10,000 divided by 40. Take a knot off, so it's 1,000 divided by 40. 250. 300 divided by 2,000. You can take a knot, two knots off top and bottom to give you 3 over 20. And number 4. Top line becomes 300 add 600. So it's 900 over 100, which is 9. The bottom line becomes 700 minus 500, which is 200. Top line is 8,000 divided by 200. Take off two knots. 80 divided by 2 is 40. Question part C. Top line is 7 plus, that would become 20, so it would be 27 divided by 11. Take away 5, which is 6. 27 divided by 6. You can, if you can't get this one, don't worry. Divide top and bottom by 3 to give you 9 over 2, which is 4.5. Part D. 100 add 300 is 400. Bottom line is 30 take away 10, which is 20. 40 divided by 2 is 20. Top line becomes 4,000. Bottom line becomes 10 times 50, which is 500. Take two knots off the top and two knots off the bottom. 40 divided by 5 is 8. And part F. It's 40 times 200 over 10 times 8. So top line becomes 8,000. Bottom line becomes 80. Take a knot of top and bottom. Gives you 800 divided by 8, which is 100. 